Hello, my name is Dustin and I'm a member of the Blue Guys Book Battle team at J.B. Atkinson Elementary School. We're going to do a book trailer for the book Barnum's Bones by Tracy Fern. This book is about Barnum Brown who discovered the most famous dinosaur in the world. The book starts off by showing a series of letters written by Barnum Brown, who is a famous paleontologist who loves digging for and finding new fossils, especially dinosaur bones. In, Car in Carbondale, Texas, on February 12, 1873, the Brown family welcomed a baby boy, who they named Barnum Brown after the most famous circ circus owner, owner in America, P.T. Barnum. Why would they name him after the circus? Well, they loved it. That's why. They were hoping that by naming him something unusual, he would, go he would do wonderful and unusual things. Barnum started off his life as a paleontologist, as a young boy collecting ancient clams, corals, snails, and scallops. He drove his mom crazy as his collection began to get out of control. First he filled his dressers, then hit his entire room, and finally his mom's front parlor. Although she was glad he was picking up such unusual hobbies, she couldn't deal with his large collection any longer and made him move his collection to the front, to the outside laundry house. After many years of studying his own collection, he finally got a chance to really show off his skills when he took a college course in paleontology at the University of Kansas. He was such a good student that he went on fossil hunts with his professor to South Dakota and Wyoming. While on his trip to South Dakota and Wyoming, he found the skull of a triceratops which measured six feet long and four and a half feet wide. Wow, Barnum loved to dress nice even though he was digging in the ground. So you would often find him wearing a fur coat, suit and tie, black boots, and a bowler cap. Finally, Barnum was hired by Henry Fairfield Osborne, who was the head on show for the American Museum of Natural History. He wanted to have the best dinosaur collection, so he hired Barnum to help grow their collection. Most people were scared of the professor, but not Burnham. He called him my dear professor. Burnham was sent by his dear professor on regular trips throughout the year to collect fossils all over the world. He always came back with a boatload of fossils and bones. to Hell Creek, Montana, while there he finally discovered something called the horn of a triceratops. Barnum did great things with his life. Hunted by raft in Canada, by elephant in India, by airplane in the United States, and by diving in Cuba. He collected more bones than anyone on Earth. Read more of the book to find out what, fam what famous dinosaur Barnum found. You won't believe it. Highly recommend you read Barnum Bones. If you love dinosaurs or are interested in becoming a paleontologist someday, this book is for you. Thanks again.